my channel and thanks for being here. So today I have some interesting and sad news to share with you guys. So if you've tried to play ARC today, you know that there is a pretty big update and we're gonna go over the patch notes. So it's March 3rd and we got the correct date. We're in the right section. All right, let's jump right in. We know you folks enjoy your event cosmetics, so as we enter into our last year of events on Arc 1, we will be adding the associated cosmetics to the Hexagon Store once each event ends. Speaking of, we've added the Love Evolved cosmetics to the Hex Store with today's patch. All of the event content will be added to the PC game at the end of the year's cycle of events so they can be opted into for our PC unofficial server owners and players. Our council players will be able to grab all of the event cosmetics from the Hex store. Oh my goodness gracious, that, <laughs> that is huge news. So before I talk more on that, I'm just gonna finish reading the rest of the patch notes for today. So it goes on to say that there's over 70 fixes related to mesh holes and foliage across the maps, fixed an issue where King Dinopithecus trophies disappeared on session restart, disabled various boss trophies from being able to be transferred to prevent them from disappearing, fixed a bug with fishing from a canoe, and fixed an exploit. Alright, so going back up to numero uno. This is insane. I mean... It's the last year for events on Arc 1. It's that time, guys. And I'm very, very sad about this news. Like, this this hits hard. It, it really does. I love Arc's events. I mean, you have Love Evolved, Excellent Adventure, Summer Bash, Fear Evolved, Turkey Trial, and Winter Wonderland. I mean, there's other events that were in the game as well, like limited time ones. We had Extinction Chronicles, Genesis 1 Chronicles, Genesis 2 Chronicles, and one that I really enjoyed was uh, the Archaeology event. That one was pretty fun too. And then there's been, you know, the Arc Anniversary slash Birthday events. Just knowing that all that's gonna end is, is really sad. I'm sorry I don't have better news for you guys, but I, I love the art community and I just was talking with my boyfriend and we both just felt the need that people need to have this information. That way everyone can, you know, enjoy the event and everything since it'll be the last one, you know, make it count. But you know, there are some upsides, not to the events being gone after this year, but there are some silver linings hidden in this sea of gray clouds. So, once, Welcome you know, the, the event ends, the cosmetics are going to be in the hexagon store. At least there is going to be an option to get that content. So that is, you know, a silver lining. Another silver lining, and this one is honestly kind of silly, but just browsing. I enjoy the taxidermy and art, <laughs> so... If you also enjoy the taxidermy and you've tried to taxidermy the uh, event creatures, you know that after the event ends, they kind of just disappear. You put it on, you know, the, the base and there's, there's nothing. So since it says here at the end of the year, um, yeah, at the end of the year cycle of events, all of it's going to be added into the game, so since it'll be into the PC game and part of the game, then they shouldn't go away. Because at their charity live stream, they did mention why some event things do disappear because they're not into like the whole game file, if that makes sense. So. But yeah, those are about the two silver linings I've found so far. <laughs> Hopefully I can find more as time goes on, but, but yeah. Well, there you have it, guys. That is today's patch notes, and I wish it was better news. I really do. This is definitely going to bum out my family and friends that also play this game. Zaya will not be pleased. I know I'm not. <laughs> but not all is bleak. We gotta stay strong, fellow ARC fans. 
may look bleak now, but there's hope on the horizon. We got the ARC animated series sometime this year, hopefully. We have Fjordor coming out in June. And eventually we'll have ARC 2. And hopefully that'll be just as good as ARC 1. Hopefully it can capture the magic and all the things we love about this game. Hopefully it can just be a worthy successor. I'll be praying. <laughs> I really want to hear from you guys. Let me know what you're thinking. Let me know what you're feeling. We're all going to be experiencing a different emotion because you know everyone's on a different wavelength. But I'm really curious to know what you guys think of this news. As always, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Chill like a penguin, and God bless. Thank you.